my oldest daughter went to school. We went. She was going to public school in Westport. She came home in tears one day, and I'm going, "What's wrong? What's wrong?" She goes. I don't have the right brand of jeans on. And I went, that's it, we're gone, we're moving, I'm out of here. So we, I kept going to, you know, uh, to live in different areas. To but I mean, like, they, they grew up with their dad as meatloaf. Well, yeah, you well, know, that's I mean, also a detriment, isn't it? I mean, you're, <laughs> meatloaf? Your dad's meatloaf? What does that mean, meatloaf? You know, I mean, I never chose that name. That name got chosen for me, and as much as I've tried to change it, and you were asking before we went on the air, you said, uh, so what, What? Uh, both of you, we, we're having an argument here, we're having this argument, is it, is it Marvin, is it Michael, is it me? Well, my dad started calling me Meat when I was a baby. My given name that they gave me at birth was Marvin, but I hated it. And the reason, first of all, nobody ever called me that. And then when I was about eight years old, Levi's put on a commercial that said, poor fat Marvin can't wear Levi's. Well, I was devastated. So in 1983, I went before a judge in Westport, Connecticut, to change my name officially to Michael. And so he said, well, there's no last, you're not changing your last name, your middle name. Why are you changing your first name? And I told him the story about Levi's <laughs> and poor fat Marvin. And normally it takes about 12 weeks for an official name change to go through. He did it on the spot. And he turns to his clerk. He turned to his clerk and went, is it too late for him to sue Levi? <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. And I, and, and I went, it's okay, Judge, it's okay. He goes, Michael, have a good day. You're now Michael. Go away. So is that the passport then? Yeah, it says Michael Lee a day. Well, Meatloaf, because Meatloaf is a, is a real name. I, that's an official name. And I put that on a, I had it on a driver's license and a passport in the 70s. And when I first went to Germany, they, they pulled me aside and kept me in a room for four hours, and they wouldn't talk to. They were if they were talking, they were in German, and I don't know, I don't speak German, you know. That's too much. We again, you know. Ha <laughs> ha. And so, and finally they go, this name Meatloaf. I'm going, yeah. They went, it's. It's funny, and I said, no, 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 no. So finally, we convinced them, but it took me four hours. So I said, you know what? Okay, I've had enough of this. Then you just.